Hello, it's me. And prepare naman natin yung uh, tawag dito is sinangag na leftover rice or sinangag na bahaw. Bahaw means leftover rice or yung tirang kanin. Kasi wala naman kami dito ang pets, like dogs or cats, para pakainin ang tirang pagkain. So, I prepare this. Ito yung tirang pagkain. Then, I cut onions and garlic and some veggies and crab sticks. So, let's start! So, ito yung ginagawa ko sa mga tirang kanin. Para hindi matasay yung food. Kaya sa itapon, so, pwede natin isang at so let's ha let's hit the pan oil. Put some oil. Transformation of the life. 
Ito ang ganda ng pizza. Hindi ko siya nilagyan ng margarine. Pero, nagkulay yellow siya. Yellow siya. Because of turmeric, turmeric, turmeric powder. Hindi ba usually sa Pinas, pag nagsasal tayo, margarine, ang bango-bango ng margarine sa Pinas, tapos ang ganda ng kulay. Dito, ang ilalagay ko is turmeric. Healthy powder. Maraming benefits ang turmeric. Search it in Google. Maraming benefits ang turmeric powder. Ito nakita nyo? Ang ganda ng kulay ng aking pinakas. Dito para ang sasap na niya kanina. It's very special pero napakasimple ba kayo. Pang hotel ba? <laughs> Pang hotel ba guys? Para na rin kayo nag-breakfast sa hotel kapag natikman nyo itong window. Sa hotel, mahal. Sa akin, mula lang. <laughs> Hindi pa tayo tapos guys. Wala pa yung lasa. Hindi pa yung gano'n. Kati natin siya pa na. Himalayan salt. So, this is healthy salt as well. Yeah. And then, brown black pepper. Lagay din ako guys na basil. Diba? Napaka-healthy. Tinalo pa yun ang hotel. Five-star hotel breakfast. Or brunch. And then oregano. I'm putting oregano as well. And let's cook it for another one minute or two minutes. Naamoy niyo lang guys, ang bago-bago niyo. So, nakikita niyo kung ano lang nilagay kong flavoring sa akin siya na. Which is very healthy. Kung ayaw niyo gumamit ng cooking oil, para hindi mo siya dapat yun yung food niyo or yun yung nga. Gumamit kayo ng butter. Hindi kang butter oil. Pero guys, napakunti naman ang nilagay kong oil. Very nice. So, kanina nakita niya na kung yung ulam ko. Actually, kahit walang ulam, pwede yung kain yung food. It's complete package na. May gulay na siya, di ba? Hindi pala. Naglagay ako ng crab sticks. Tapos may gulay na rin. It's a very healthy brunch. So, I think it's done. Let's switch up the, or turn up the heat. So, now, luto na ang ating sinangad for today. Itatransfer natin siya sa serving bowl. So, I think, kaya ko na maubusin ko kasi, as I told, as I know, one half, one and a half, ah, uh, couple of shots. So, let's now. So, kanina, tapos ko nang lutuin yung aking ngag na rice. Uh, yung bahaw na kanin na ni-repair natin at ginawa natin oh, masarap na sinagag, sinang, sinanga, sinangag na pang hotel. Coffee. Milk. Sugar. Chia seeds. So, ready na ang ating hot water. So, let, I will show you how I'm pouring it to my cup. So, this is my hot water from this high. You will see. Mataas ako magsali. Ooh. Whoa. Nice. Sige niya ba? Ready na ready na ang coffee. Mmm. Ang bango guys. Tinalo pa niya ng Starbucks. Sa bango. This is my brunch. Ang aking sinangag. Coffee. That's it, guys. What else you can do with your leftover rice? Please comment down below your answer. I would love to read it. You can feed it to your pet.
Try other recipe to remake the rice by adding some ingredients. Rice cheese balls. Rice pakora. Rice cutlets. Rice soup the trending luga. Rice pudding. Rice balls. Rice cakes. And more.